Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. Today we're going to be checking out another performance from The Warning. Alright, so first of all, before I actually get into this, let me just take the time to thank you guys uh, for your very warm welcome uh, to the world of The Warning and for all of your comments and all the information that you gave me on my last reaction video. Um, since I'm sure a lot of you are new to the channel, I did just want to briefly mention uh, that a lot of times I don't have the opportunity, uh, the, the time to respond to the individual comments. Um, I deal with some chronic health issues and so one of the consequences of this is I have very limited time to devote to my content. Um, so I of course spend most of it either filming or editing. And so yeah, one of the unfortunate drawbacks is I often don't get the chance to sit and go through and read and respond to all the comments, but I do try to read them as much as possible as they're coming in uh, and I get notifications. So I am reading what you say and I appreciate it, even if you don't necessarily get a response comment or something from me. So I just wanted to let you guys know that and hopefully you don't mind too much. But thank you again so much for like, all the information. If you see, Spec is right here on my lap. He wanted attention. So here's my kitty. That's what's going on. Um, but yes, so the performance I'm going to check out today is actually Choke. Um, and you guys had a lot of different suggestions for like the order in which I should check stuff out. But this one in particular was special requested by one of my viewers um, who has contributed to multiple things for me in the past, including this lipstick, which is amazing. Um, so I wanted to get this reaction out for him, but yeah, I, I will also be checking out other stuff from them. And I do apologize also because I was told that the last one that I checked out was kind of like the, the end part of a story. So it, it, like you don't get the context without all of it, but that's okay. I still have time and I can go back and put everything together. So and, and I really enjoyed uh, their first performance, so I'm excited to continue checking out more from them. I was not aware that they are sisters, which is absolutely awesome. Um, so they are actually a group of three sisters, and they are from Monterey and uh, Mexico. Ugh, Mexico. Um, and I actually, I pulled up a little biography here, and... You guys also mentioned that, because I regularly commented on throughout that first video, um, that it's rare to see a lead singer also be the drummer. And you guys mentioned that she isn't the only one that does lead singing. Um, in fact, the, the sister um, on the guitar, and who also sometimes plays piano, um, also does lead singing on some of the songs. And I think this one is her correct um so i'm looking at it it says daniela uh is guitar piano lead and backing vocals paulina drums piano lead and backing vocals so she was mostly doing the lead vocals uh on the last one i reacted to to the, the warning and alejandra is bass piano and backing vocals so i also think that's really cool um not just the fact that it's rare to have multiple ex multiple people in your family who are talented enough to be lead singers but the fact that they want to all share the spotlight as much as possible i think is really cool so um yeah i'm gonna read this biography later too but obviously i'm not gonna take the time to do the whole thing in this video because that would be extremely boring for you guys especially since you already know all of this but it's very cool i think it's awesome the, that they're a sisters group and that they are become successful so yes, this is going to be Choke. Let's check it out together. Here we go. I won't say goodbye in the end. It won't matter. Oh, you hear the crowd singing along? Okay, so people really know this one. I'm so Woo, okay, all right, all right. You know, I always love it when a song does that to you. 
like slow romantic lead in. Woof! Okay, her voice is awesome too. Her voice is amazing. I love when rock singers have voices like this where they can perform. It's very... They're powerful, right, like, kind of edge for rock, but also melodic and um... Ooh. Okay, I love this part. I love this transition into the chorus. She's mostly, mostly does backup, but she's got a little solo vocal behind her there. having a lot of fun listening to that okay so that was fantastic um i might even like this one uh better i might even like this one better than uh the end that's the name of the other one right the end stars always seem to fade uh i actually think i might even like this one better which is crazy because I really, really enjoyed that song, and I legitimately, as I said I was going to in that reaction, I legitimately added it to just my regular daily playlist of songs that I listen to, and I'm definitely putting this one on there too. Like, not just that, I'm going to be editing videos once I'm done filming this reaction, <laughs> I'm probably gonna have this song on repeat for a while because I'm one of, I don't know about you guys, but I'm one of those people that when I hear a song and I really, really enjoy it, I can listen to it over and over again on repeat for a while. Uh, I know some people would definitely not be a fan of that, but I have always been that way ever since I was even just a little kid. I remember being in the car and always asking my parents to repeat the song that I was listening to over and over again and obviously they got incredibly sick of it but that's just me and I'm still like that and so yeah this is gonna be on repeat for a while while I'm editing because that was badass um I really enjoyed everything about it I was really impressed uh by the vocal performances and just I mean 
the power of her voice. I talked about this a little bit while the actual reaction was happening, while I was actually listening. Um, but it's, of course, always kind of difficult uh, to, to, you don't want to talk over all of the song. Um, but I love voices like that, especially in a rock band. Um, when your singer is somebody that has a powerful voice, of course, is always needed uh, in a rock group. And you always need a bit of an edge to it as well. Um, but on top of that, she has just such a beautiful voice, like melodic in the sense that she could perform completely different types of music if she wanted to. Uh, ones that were more entirely focused on kind of like the beauty of the singer's voice. Um, she clearly has that capability, um, but she's applying it here into rock songs to, and I, I, the, I just absolutely love when that is happening. So, so yeah, this was great. I really enjoyed it. I mean, I think you guys can probably tell that by now, but as always, I want to hear more suggestions from you. So if you specifically would like me to check out a performance or song of theirs next, please do leave that in the comments below, as well as anything else you would like to talk about or if you have other recommendations. Um, like I said, I don't necessarily always get the chance to respond to the comments, but I am reading them as much as possible and I appreciate the information and you guys' support. So thank you very much for joining me and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.